council of mosque that we have in town homeless. So, and we have a we have a um, synagogue just adjacent to the mosque, and uh, its history goes back more than the history of Ishtar Mosque. We came in 1910. People at the time, but synagogue came in 18, 18, 1899. So, there hasn't been any incidents in this area regarding synagogue. It's a community, it's a small Jewish community, and uh, in the first. Um, in the beginning, when the mosque uh, fund was being formed in 1910, there had been Jewish, Christian, and other dignitaries who had been helping in building a mosque in this area. So if we list the agreements and disagreements between any, any two human beings, you'll find a number of disagreements, but you'll find a lot of agreements. So Abrahamic faith and in Islam is mentioned in, in the verse that Prophet Abraham al is the father of the father of the nation. So and Judaism, Christianity, Islam, they are from the uh, same root. And there are historical differences, there are some theological differences. But till the end of this world there will be differences. But uh, the best people are those who can live together in, in spite of differences as we live in our family. So many thanks Rabbi Mark Weiner, many thanks to all of you. You spent a lot of time. And um, so we'll continue to have more discussions, more talk, and sometimes probably robust on many other issues. And uh, the bottom line is we want this area, London and Britain, to be a safer place. Media always will go for sensation. But I fully agree with Rabbi that it's our community's collective responsibility uh, to isolate the extremists, come out and speak up. There is an opportunity, all sorts of opportunities, in the media, in politics, in civil society, to make our voice known. And hopefully, our future generations will uh, take cue from there, and uh, we we'll try to work harder and better, and uh, make Britain a prosperous, safer country. Because our religion talks about peace and harmony. Same with the other religions and uh, Abrahamic faith, faiths are important and Islam has given special privilege to the Ahli Kitab, the Jews and Christians. So let's work together, let's uh, uh, on positive things and if we agree to disagree on certain things, let's, 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 let's be clear about that. So once again, thank you very much. Yeah. Assalamu alaikum, peace be upon you.